Uh, OK, I talked fast up to this point because it's all about this. This is a film put out by our good friends at Garage House Pictures. They're an organization out of Philadelphia that puts out uh, films that have never hit video before, have never hit Blu-ray or VHS. Uh, this one, I think, had a VHS release, but movies that have not been easy to see, so it's usually their debut. Um, this is a lovely widescreen presentation of a pretty obscure drive-in film made in the Philippines back in the mid-70s. Um, it was a long, hard road to get this out on video, but they just kept they just kept banging away at it. Harry and the gangs kept banging away at it until they were able <laughs> to put it out on video. This is the story of a man and his... Okay, what I'm gonna tell you is this. There's no trailer for this film, okay? So what you're gonna see is a bunch of dialogue lines clipped together that give you a sense of what this movie is like. And what I need to tell you is that he's talking about a chicken, okay? Anybody who tunes in part way, he's talking about a chicken. He's talking about a rooster that fights, okay? So this is Ross Hagen talking about his supercock. You have something more to declare? Just my cock. He has the largest cock I've ever seen. How would you like to come up to my hotel room and meet Friendly? Friendly? That's the name of my cock. Well, how do you condition your cock anyway? Well, he has to be healthy and strong. It's got to have that smooth, round, hard feeling of well-finished muscle. Well, I come straight to the point, Mr. Calhoun. Is there any way I could interest you in parting with your cock? My dear Mr. Calhoun, I must take a closer look at your cock. There's more than one way to get that cowboy's cock! Uh, gentlemen, I would like to propose a toast to our cocks. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Hi, how are you? Um, just having an emotional moment with Ross Hagen's cock there for a second. Uh, so this is what this movie is. So there was, there, there was this, uh, cockfighting is a thing, uh, illegal in the US, legal in the Philippines. So that would be a lot of Filipino movies of the 70s, you'd see there'd be the cockfighting scene because it was kind of exotic and taboo to have that. And then you had a movie called uh, Cockfighter, AKA Born to Kill, starring Warren Oates, which is a really good movie about an American in the South who does that sport. Uh, you had Rooster Spurs of Death. You had a couple of cockfighting, the, the brief vogue of cockfighting movies in the 70s. And then Ross Hagen and the gang get together and say, we're gonna do this, but we're gonna use that kind of taboo word as often as possible. So I'm watching this movie and I'm like, oh, this is just some kind of you know, cockfighter knockoff. And then I, they start using it and I'm like, wait a minute, they, they know what they're doing here. This is really funny. And I'm sitting in my bedroom at home and I'm laughing my ass off through this whole movie and I keep rewinding it and I'm like, I can't believe this dialogue. This is, fa this is fantabulous. So this movie, it's a, it's a drive-in movie, it's a comedy. It's about this cowboy, this Tom Selleck looking cowboy who comes to the Philippines with his famous cock, it's a rooster, and everybody's trying to get their hands on his cock, it's a rooster. And uh, he's, it's the World Cockfighting Championship, and they're trying to, you know, put his cock out of business. It's a rooster. And uh, trying to, you know, they just want to get his hands on his, his muscular bird. And uh, it's just endless dialogue like that. It's like they sat down and, like, how many double entendre cock jokes can we come up with about roosters that will work in this film? And the answer is about 80 minutes worth. I loved this movie so much. This was, this is the movie of the week for me. For, you can have your end game. I will have Ross Hagen Supercock in my game all day long. Um, it's fantastic. So the, the transfer looks great. This is a Blu-ray from Garage House Pictures. Again, you can get it online, Diabolic, DVD, Amazon, everywhere. It's a pretty limited edition. So I think if you want to get this, you probably sooner than later is a good idea. And uh, there's, a, a, there's a commentary with Fred Olin Ray. Uh, who was sort of the rights owner for this and who knew Ross Hagen very well. I haven't had a chance to get to that yet. I really wanted to listen to that before I came here to see if I had any more uh, cock stories for you. And uh, it's just, it's a great package, so to speak. I will also say, I almost wore it today. Uh, Garage House is selling a super cock uh, baseball shirt with the logo of the film, which is like a championship looking uh, rooster with a logo under it. And uh, it's, a, it's a prized possession of mine. So uh, if you want to get your hands on super cock, Go online and find it. It is totally worth the time and length you go to to get it. So.